Hey there, this is Guitar Hero 3 Rocks, and you're watching Fable 2 Character Customizations. In this episode, I will be showing you how to create your very own Sasuke from the anime Naruto. Now, to start off with, if you've watched any of my other videos, you will know that I would usually start off talking about abilities, but I'm not really going to do much of that in this episode. But I will say that for I would advise a few will abilities, and any of you who watch Naruto will know that I'm talking about the Jutsus, okay? So if I just pull the abilities screen up here, okay. Now I would rep I would recommend level one for blades as this could represent throwing kunai if you wanted to so for level one blades I would recommend level two inferno for the fireball jutsu I would recommend level three time control to represent the shutting gun because any of you that have watched Naruto will know that when he uses the shine gun he can copy his opponent's abilities and when he's reading their moves if they was attacking him it is as if they were moving in slow motion so time control kind of represents that so we just put that on to level three and I don't really have one for slot five but I would recommend level four shock as to represent the Chidori. Okay, so there's all of your abilities. Now, on to his appearance. I'll just bring up the dies here. To start off with, I would recommend the mullet hairstyle because the hair is all swept backwards. I mean, it's not exactly pointing out but it's all swept back so it's kind of like how Sasuke has his hair and then you want your moonless midnight dye here and dye his hair black okay so just dye his hair black then for his outfit of course you just seen clips of it there for what I'll be using for this video um, most of his outfit is just dyed with the true blue dye. Parts of these that are used with the true blue dye are the bandana, which is, in this is called the striped bandana, and you can get it from the guy selling stuff in the gypsy camp. And you want to dye the primary and secondary colors using your true blue dye so there's your blue headband now for the shirt I I personally use the pauper shirt but you could always use something else if you wanted to and again primary and secondary so he has a blue shirt and obviously you want monk boots again because they kind of represent the shoes that they have in Naruto you just dye them blue again and for the trousers, you'll want them dyed with your kilo white dye. But I found that there are at least two options for this. You could either have highwayman trousers, because if you've watched the anime, you know that they have a strap on their leg with their kunai on it. But even though this is on the left leg and Sasuke is right handed I guess it could depend because people have it on the leg for which hand they are so if you're right handed you would have it on your right leg and obviously with this it's on his left leg but you cast spells with your left hand on this game so if you were using the blades then I guess it kind of matches up but for actually wearing shorts because Sasuke wears shorts in the anime, um, 
you could just use what I do, which is the noble gents trousers, because there's kind of a gap between where the monk boots end and where the nobleman's, sorry, where the noble gents trousers end. So there's kind of a gap there revealing part of his leg. So it kind of gives it the effect that they are actually shorts. And then you just want to dye the primary and secondary of the noble gents trousers because the secondary color on the trousers is like the stripe down the side so you want to dye that white also so that it does not um, compromise the outfit shall I say with um, well, the color that's well that shouldn't really be there so there's your outfit for Sasuke now again any of you that watch my other videos would know that I would also talk about weapons for this, I wasn't really too sure what to pick because kunai, daggers, whatever you want to call them, there's no actual daggers in Fable 2. The thing that even comes close to a dagger would be a cleaver, but I don't necessarily like to use them because in the place of a kunai because they just appear too big on your character's back and frankly I think the blade is just ridiculously oversized so again the blade is ridiculous so that part is entirely up to you but I personally I use the Daichi mostly just because I have it but it's also really powerful so I just use the Daichi Katana which is the legendary katana. Again, with ranged weapons, not really any suggestions, so again, I just use the red dragon pistol. Um, note for most of my future videos, I probably will just say about using the Daichi and the red dragon because obviously the red dragon is a pistol, so you can use it, and when you're not, it doesn't appear on your back like a rifle would, so it's as if he doesn't even have anything but as for the swords obviously when I finally get around to doing the uh, Prince of Persia video I probably will end up saying to use the Daichi obviously not just because it's a very long sword but if any of you have played like Warrior Within at the very start you have the Golden Eagle Sword and this kind of represents it because there's an eagle at the tip of the handle just down there and the blade itself because it's actually a katana is curved so and because where the hilt would be on the daichi there's like this little thing that grips the end of the handle and the start of the blade so it kind of does resemble the golden eagle sword so there's a little preview for the prince of persia video get yourself the Daichi Katana okay so I think that's just about everything I've got to wrap this up before I go over the 10 minute time limit so <laughs> yeah good luck making your own uh, Sasuke uh, have fun with him uh, I don't really think there's anything else I could say apart from uh, I don't know watch Naruto if you wanted to because I think it is good I personally am watching the Naruto Shippuden episodes right now, but, um, yeah, have fun, uh, feel free to rate, comment, or even post a video response, or, um, yeah, stay tuned for Prince of Persia and other characters. Also, feel free to send me posts for your ideas on characters for me to make, and I'll try and make an attempt at making them for you, and then posting back a video so I'm Guitar Free Rocks and this is Fable 2 Character Customizations. Later.